This video will explain how to connect, set up, and get TV sound through your home theater system. First, connect the speakers by attaching the color-coded speaker wires to the same color terminals on the main unit as shown. Insert the other end of the cables into the connection terminals on the back of each speaker. Insert the wires fully, taking care not to insert them beyond the wire insulation. Connect the white wire to the plus terminal and the blue striped line wire to the negative terminal. Place the front, center and surround sound speakers at approximately the same distance from the seating position and the subwoofer off to one side of the TV. The subwoofer can be placed anywhere that's convenient. We highly recommend connecting your new Panasonic home theater to a high definition TV through an HDMI cable. This is the only connection that can provide pristine Blu-ray picture quality. The HDMI cable carries both the HD video and audio together. The HDMI cable is also required to view 3D videos and 3D still photos. To connect using HDMI, plug an HDMI cable into the HDMI ARC AV Out terminal on the back of the main unit. Then plug the other end of the HDMI cable into an available HDMI in terminal on your TV. An HDMI ARC input terminal on the TV is preferred. Another connection option is to use the home theater's digital input, also known as optical. You can connect the cable or satellite box to the home theater using an optical cable as shown. This will allow you to enjoy true surround sound. If your TV has an optical out terminal, connect an optical cable to this terminal and plug the other end into the digital audio in terminal on the back of the home theater. Lastly, another option is to connect red and white audio cables to the red and white audio out terminals on your cable or satellite box and connect the other ends of the cables to the home theater's red and white AUX terminals. Then connect the AC power cord to the home theater, but don't turn the power on yet. First set the TV to the input connection you choose for the home theater so you'll be able to visually see what the home theater is outputting. Now turn the home theater on for the first time. The Easy Setup screen will appear on the TV automatically. Use the arrow buttons on the home theater remote control to select Yes. Then press OK to start the process. In the Speaker Layout menu, the Surround Layout is recommended if you have placed your speakers in standard surround positioning. That is, three speakers and the subwoofer in front of the seating position and two speakers behind. Depending on the room layout, you may prefer to use all the speakers in front of the seating position. In this situation, select Front Layout. Now you'll test the speaker connections. To do this, highlight Speaker Check and press OK at the next screen. Listen to each speaker for a tone. Please note that the subwoofer sound will be different from the other speakers. When the speaker check is complete, you will see the message, Can Sound Be Heard? Select Yes if the test was successful. You have two listening options with your home theater sound system. Select Multi-Channel Out if you want all the speakers to output sound all of the time, even if you're playing a two-channel source such as an iPod, FM radio, or CD. Or select Standard Out if you want all the speakers to output sound only when a surround sound signal is available, such as from a Blu-ray or DVD disc. Make your selection and press OK. There is an additional surround sound option that can be enabled if you prefer called 3D Cinema Surround. This feature creates a 3D impression that sound is coming from all directions. Next, select the preferred audio input to play your TV sound through the home theater sound system. Select ARC if you are connected to an ARC-capable TV through the HDMI ARC connection, as we showed you earlier. Choose Digital In if you are using an optical digital audio cable. Choose Auxiliary if you are using the red and white audio outputs from your TV or cable box and are connected to the red and white auxiliary terminals on the main unit. You may want to set the main unit to power up faster by turning on the quick start feature. 
Select On and press OK. Your Easy Setup is now complete. You can repeat Easy Setup at any time from the Home Theater Setup menu. Thank you for choosing Panasonic.